Hey, hey, learners, I hope that you were having a great day. What is science? Science is the systematic study of the world around us. The word systematic means to do something in an organized way. A scientist makes observations about the world through the five senses of sight, smell, hearing, touch and taste. We say that information that we gain through our five senses is empirical evidence. In South Africa, there are four scientific themes that we study. Life and living is about living things and how they exist on our planet Earth. Matter and materials is about the structure of different materials that are natural and how they are used. Energy and change is about how we use energy sources and how energy changes. The Earth and Beyond is about our planet Earth, space and creatures that existed a long time ago. We said that science is the systematic study of the world. The scientist uses the scientific method. There are six stages to the scientific method. AIM, Apparatus and Materials hypothesis, method, observations, and conclusion. All scientific investigations begin with a question. People have problems in the world. People ask questions about the problems. The problems need to be resolved during scientific investigations. Here are some questions asked about problems. The aim tells us what the scientist wants to investigate to solve a problem. The aim is a statement of the question for the investigation. The aim always begins with the words to determine. To determine means to find out. The apparatus is a list of materials and equipment that the scientist will need to complete the investigation. The hypothesis is a prediction that the scientist makes about what could happen in the investigation. The hypothesis always begins with the words I predict. The method explains the procedures that are followed during the investigation. The scientist needs to record the procedure of the investigation. The scientist needs to be very clear about the procedures, so that other scientists can understand how the investigation was completed. The observations are what the scientists experience through the five senses during the investigation. The scientist needs to record the observations so that other scientists can know what happened in the investigation.
The conclusion is what the scientist can decide from the investigation. The conclusion resolves the problem posed in the aim. The conclusion proves or disproves the prediction made in the hypothesis. The conclusion is based upon the observations. From the conclusion, the scientist can formulate a scientific rule about the investigation. In this lesson you learnt that science is the systematic study of the world around us. You learnt that a scientist makes observations about the world through the five senses. When a scientist gathers information through the five senses, empirical evidence has been used. You also learnt the six stages of the scientific method and how it is used in scientific investigations. You are a young scientist. You will use the scientific method in natural sciences at school. Can you think of ways in which you use the scientific method in everyday life? Ha 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 